Hey, hey, hey. Hakumaldo Crypto here, finally, with another Bitcoin update. And yes, we have a movement and a breakout. We were for 60 days, actually more, right? Uh, we were for like uh, 63 days in that range. 1000 range, 12%, 12, 38% trying to to decide uh, to break to the upside or to the downside and then finally we broke to the downside okay this is bitphoenix i'm not gonna uh, base my analysis on bitphoenix because bitphoenix is now 400 dollars above above bitstamp and i'm gonna disregard this okay so <clears throat> this is my daily chart uh, as i have been presenting it uh, I was, of course, as everyone, uh, I, I believe, as everyone was as well, in this, uh, uh, with a lot of indecision, what on uh, on how to to label this. Yeah, as I said, this would be an ABC, a, then it would have an E. So this is a huge bear trap, right? Huge. So. The overall picture is that we have this triple combo and we are now finishing perhaps this Z here. If you disregard this whole ABC, this whole triangle here. To make sense of this triangle here, what I'm doing is I am using I am uh, considering that this triangle here is part of a B wave of uh, this uh, this B wave of this X, so we will need to go and of course have a new high, a new local high at least, at least uh, stop at this 50%, and then we would go down again. So this huge dump here would be just part of the triangle. So um, and we got to, we almost get to one of the first algo targets here minus 33 60% which I marked here. See guys, this is a, it's where I am, when I, where I am, uh, where I market strong support. This is a minus 618, minus 2360%. And this is rough, this is 5296, okay? Then we have another one here, 4200. So uh, if this breaks, down to this green line here i gotta tell you guys it's not it's this count here is invalidated okay we, we want we won't go we won't have another wave up and then go down we would just simply finish this z here okay uh, a lot of analysts are calling this like an ending diagonal this uh, this is not impossible okay the, actually, this is likely that we would have some kind of ending diagonal here, okay? Um, something like this. Um, then this would be sort of a ending ending diagonal, okay? Um, and but f we need yet to break down below this um, this green line here this is strong support minus 3360% minus 618 and then we that would that would get that would uh, that would get us to the 5000 level that would be a really really uh, that would be a surprise for everyone and uh, not a surprise actually if you have been following my analysis a lot of people have been calling me a lot uh, a perma bear or some <laughs> i don't know <laughs> any <laughs> something <laughs> something like that and i'm not a perma bear i'm just analyzing the market what the market gives to us so that, that's what the market is giving us now we don't exactly uh, ha 
I don't have a lot of data now indicating that we are going to have this C here. Okay, but we have this triangle here that is still valid. This this uh, huge week here, this which huge candle here can could be a E wave here, a throw off, and then we would go up. Okay, but we don't have only and only if this strong support here holds. Okay, this is what I ha I have to. This is what I I have to say, you guys. This all the indicators is showing the same. It's a bear trap. Okay, we try it. We fail to go above 50, 59 in the RSI. We almost we move we we move so little. We moved in the OBV a little bit above this line here. Oopsie. And then down. Okay, I think um, eight billions. Uh, just wiped out of the of market cap so a lot of money has been taken off of course we are approaching the end of the year this is normal for the markets right so we need to take into account a lot of other var variables so don't forget that right everything happens in the mar everything happens in the market for a reason and of course we have the, uh, an underlying reason for it so we are now out of this range which is starting to make us think about a lot of things so uh <clears throat> yes again this is this was my two hour chart not was but it is still my two hour chart because it actually it's it's exactly what i was expecting okay uh not here but this was a by b my C wave would finish B, then we would go down to C. C? <laughs> C? <laughs> but this C here is just. Uh, I have the same target here as I have here for the daily. If we go below that target here, which is pretty close, I, I, I call this double bottom, but <laughs> the, the market had no interest whatsoever in this double bottom so forget about it the market just went through through it and that's it done this support all the supports now here all the supports done just strong like a, a, a really breakout must be breaking all the supports and all this information here is irrelevant now right it was relevant to the remember it was relevant to the 61000 holding but the 61000 is now the ship has pretty much passed okay um we got we we must consider this possibility here though yeah that we have some kind of one two and then this is a three we need to consider it okay if this is the case okay if this is the case we have some kind of one here instead of an a then this whole structure here is a two are you following me yes this is a one then this whole structure here is a two if you want to make the case that we are in a wave c we are finishing the Z, okay? Um, this would be A, B, um, this would be X, right? Uh, this was my, my old count, right? Um, this would be A, B, and then we would have this whole, this would be a one, two, and then it would be uh, three four five yes that that this would be the ending diagonal uh, the ending diagonal structure okay this would be our a b and then this would be our c we wouldn't have this triangle <coughs> guys wouldn't have but this is actually uh, the shape of it is so particular right it's difficult to not see it as a triangle right a b c d 
but I need to give you guys, I need to give you guys that indeed it's difficult to see this structure here as a throw off. Okay? Gotta tell you that. If we indeed have some kind of a. I'm sorry, I, 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 this is, is a little bit of a. I'm put. I'm, I am pushing a little bit too hard this A, B, C, D, E. It, it doesn't make sense in the structure that we are seeing it. This is a clear breakout and we don't have an E here. So I'm, I'm gonna, this, I, I actually I'm gonna disregard this information here. I'm put this X here. And uh, let me change it. Okay, that's what, I, that's what we do here. Making sense of this, right? Trying to make sense of this. So we have an A, a B. This would be B. But then if you want to make this triangle, it would be A, B, C, D, E. And then we would have this. Yes, could be. Could be, guys. Follow me here. huh? Okay, follow me here. Um, then we would have this, this structure here. Let me turn this in. I don't know. Uh, actually, I prefer it here. Right, then we have this throw off here. It's okay. We have more points of intersection for our wave B here. Then we have this wave A here. A, so we have an A, B. B, we have an A, B, C, D, and then E. Is that so? A, actually A, I'm sorry. A would be here. Now we have, let, let, let me change the degree of this one here. It's not a mean minus Q. Okay, now inside of this B wave, we would have a triangle, okay? <laughs> The triangle would start here. Um, I'm gonna remove those uh, just to to make it clear to clear the clutter, right? So I'm I'm gonna start the triangle here. Oopsie, not this one. This one. Like C. Okay. So we will have an A, B, C, D, E, right? We have a triangle. So this is the triangle. A, B, C, A, B, C, D, E. Okay. So this is not, this is not, this is a, a really nice count actually, huh? We have a, a, a kind of a, a really weird looking C wave, which is common. And we have this throw off, which is actually not a throw off. If we, if we consider that we need to start the, the, the triangle here, right? Start at the A wave where it's, where we, where it, where we, where we, where we have the triangle. So we would have it's starting here, the bottom line here. We have a clear bottom line, bottom trend line, but we don't have a clear uh, upper line. But this is the triangle, and we broke out of it. Okay, so here we have an A, B, C. If we are to consider anything of this, uh, any sort of a uh, triangle I think this one is a, a good case for us so where are we gonna stop hmm we have this target here so why is finished Y has finished here okay X has finished here it's remember I'm not I'm not gonna this I'm not gonna take out of the table that the case that we might see a uh, X here going up but considering this structure here I think that this is the best 
the best way of counting it okay and then we would have some kind of a, of a any diagonal here for the C probably okay so we have a lot of targets for our for our oh see look look at this weekly chart guys we have for the first time uh, break break below the 100 EMA we have this cross here we have this cross here uh, the MACD the the <clears throat> sorry the RSI is tickling down the of course the OBV is not really showing anything whatsoever we, we haven't had time for it but look at this nasty candle okay we had in, we had in the pre, for one two three weeks indecision indecision and indecision and then we have this huge candle we bro, we broke through the 100 EMA so easily <laughs> that is amazing isn't it I am I am I am really I am really waiting for this for this um for to, I'm waiting to see where it's gonna when it's gonna stop where it's where we go, where we're gonna see some kind of um um of support of a real support okay um where I where we, I have another chart with a lot of targets I don't remember where I put it. It, it uh, it's probably this one. It's not this one because I have a lot of targets for. We have a, a, a oh yes, we have this. This would be, I think I I expect. If you're gonna stop here, some perhaps we are gonna have some kind of perhaps. Really, um, it's a, a strong. I would make a strong case that we're gonna stop here minus 33 60 percent for the to get some kind of we're we are gonna see some kind of support here, okay? This is um, what this is uh, 5200. Then we're gonna see if we are, of course, this is gonna be this is this looks like a wave three so we are not this is a wave three and we'll have a wave four and then a wave five we have an hour target here minus 32 60 percent of a huge of a huge movement of a huge retracement uh this retracement here guys from this highest point here to this lowest here so this is 4700 okay so two targets really important targets 5200 and 4700 okay first target and then the second target i think that we are gonna see those targets and for every analyst out there that said oh bitcoin is never gonna see uh six below 6k ever so guys do not <laughs> do not be like this okay do not <laughs> do don't be so strong about your opinions because the market is here to surprise us okay and indeed bitcoin has has uh has broke has uh has broken down to the downside and has put in a new a new a new highest a, a new uh, a new lowest low of the year <laughs> So that's what we have. Okay, so I'm gonna change this thing here because I, I'm not really happy with with what we have. It, 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 okay, it's uh, it's almost the same thing. You fall just to to make it clear for you guys. Um, C would start here. Okay, we won't have this E here. It's all, it's the same count. Okay, that I'm proposing here. Okay, I'm just gonna adjust this uh this is a a this is a, a b here and then a c okay so um this is our a. a this is our b then we have the triangle okay this is a a b c d e like i charted and then we have our c here of course to finish 
our to finish our wave Z. Okay, where is Z? Where is Z? Where is Z? I don't know where is Z. Okay, and I'm sorry if I'm if I'm a bit I'm a bit crazy, but I'm excited with this movement. Seriously, I am. I, I love it. I love when we we see some movement and when the when the market is preparing for it, and then we are all and we are all. <laughs> Oh my God, we are all excited and looking at it and not really knowing what to do. It's, that's, that's the important lesson about trading. Be prepared, okay? So this is our B here and then we have this C here, okay? But th this is the triangle, okay? Don't forget it. This is an A, B, C, just like here. A, A, B, oopsie. A, B, C, D, E, and then we broke out. We are now going down. We have plenty of targets. Indeed, we broke down. We, we now uh, sit, we, we now, uh, we are now our, um, we are now facing some kind of support, some kind of a, uh, support here at this region, but are we gonna stop here? It's, uh, where 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 right let me let me see where where it would where would you consider this this is not support not any furthermore not this nor this one here this the all those supports here done okay what about this this was my this is over okay this is the triangle that we have been since September. This is an A, B, okay. So this is the end. This is the E wave here, okay. Let, let, let me mark it. Sorry, this video is going to be a bit uh, longer than usual, but it's it's going to be interesting. B, C, D, E, okay. This is the... Uh, you might have a different count for this. Let me know. Damn, so nice. So this is a one, two. One, two, then a three, four, five. That's it. This is gonna be oh yeah. See? This is a huge, 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 huge. Huge extension. Two six one eight, four hundred three. Oh, there we have it. See, forty forty three hundred sixty. So we have a target here. It's a bit really long, but this this we have a, a a wave one here. See, one is here. Then a two, then a one two. And then this tree here. So, then we would have a four and a five. Then we would finish this C wave and Z. So I expect not. I expect nothing else, but uh, but more, more red. But of course, the market is gonna stabilize a little bit and find some support. Remember. In order to understand what is happening now, we need to take a look at the past as well, right? This is, this has never, this level of this 5,400 5, has never, um, was, was visited uh, in, uh, in, in, this was what, 2007, October, right? This was October last year. Right, October seventy. No, oh, yeah, yeah. When we, this was a region that we 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 visited in October, and then we had this. Uh, this was what November. So this region was was visited almost at the same time, almost at the same period of time last year. This is a, a really interesting fact, isn't it? And now we are 
finding support at this region. So it's, it's, I would say no coincidence, right? So pay attention on this region. Pay attention of, of um, it's a historical region, of course, well, not a, a huge, uh, I, I gotta say you guys, a huge resistance, a, a, huge, a huge support would be where? Here would be the next huge support. We do, we won't we don't have a lot of. This is the cluster that we I am expecting. Forty seven. It's here, right? Yes, forty seven. Forty eight is here. We don't have a lot of uh, movement. A lot of we don't have a lot of uh, indecision in, around this region. But this region here, hmm was visited last year guys so let me mark it okay oopsie going down all the way to the 5100 so remember i just said it it would be a really interesting region going to this 5100 okay 5k guys 5k just like we had in October last year, starting on October, it, starting October 2017 and then ending November, 12 November. Hmm, we visited, we visited again in 12 November. We've 50, uh, we, 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 we had a dump down to the, oopsie, let me check it. A dump down to the, 5500 so hmm really interesting moment for bitcoin guys pay attention because this is gonna be uh, uh when we have such a a huge movement is when we are, we need to uh we need to consider our options and we need to take actions okay so are we gonna be waiting for it? I or are we gonna be waiting for shorting Bitcoin? I I am definitely shorting it. Okay, I, I said that there was this was my stop loss for short. This was this green line here was my stop loss for long. Yes, I have I have both. Okay, but but I have uh, a lot more to add to my short position so then when it break when it broke it here oopsie when it broke here i add more to my position to my short position so th this is what we have now okay i add more to my short position my my stop loss was here so then go down we are going when it when it gets here i'm thinking about getting some profit 5100 Okay, this is what the the chart is telling me. If I fail to to get it to the, if if it goes past through it, I'm not gonna be unhappy and say, oh my goodness, I should have waited. This is a, this is bad psychology, guys. You need to 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 set up a price. You need to to analyze the market and have your targets. Okay, so beautiful i i'm really glad that we are starting to finally get to some of those algo targets here and i expect to get below 5000 okay just to wrap up here okay again i'm gonna post this start this chart here on my twitter guys um that's it thanks for watching uh i'm really happy to have you guys here sorry for for waiting for letting you guys wait for a, a proper update because I was waiting for Bitcoin as well, and this is a breakout. <laughs> this is a, a breakout. This is significant, and we are going down 5,300. Oh my goodness! <laughs> by the time you by the time you watch you by the time you guys watch it, watch this video. Bitcoin is probably gonna be like. Uh, finding some support and perhaps uh, reacting and let's see tomorrow i'm gonna be probably giving you guys an update and i'm gonna be thinking about a different count as well okay if you haven't followed me on twitter please consider doing so 
and join us in our Discord. It's the Crypto Trader Educational Institute. Thank you very much, guys, and enjoy this time. Bear markets are fun. We have plenty of opportunities to buy now, guys. Bye-bye. Cheers.